we drove up to Huntsville for a day of hiking. And Chuck is pulling me because he's sniffing everything. But it's fine. He's just excited. So it's a day for me and him just to have adventures and have fun. For him to get some exercise. And just a day for us too. <laughs> Cool. Hear the water. So it's a really, really gorgeous day. Um, I guess one of the things when we came into the driving into this park, there's a sign that says alligators do live here. So Chuck and I stumbled across a camp area that was next to the lake. So we went down by it to take a little selfie. And I just kept thinking, please, please don't let there be any alligators right here. I don't want to get eaten by an alligator. But anyways. It kind of looked like there's something that had been sliding through that area. Maybe it was a person with their boat. Maybe it was an alligator. I don't know. But we didn't get eaten. So. Woohoo. But it is really pretty out here. And great weather for hiking. Um, I'm probably going to have to shed this sweater in a moment and the beanie because I'm kind of getting hot. Uh, but Chuck still sniffing everything and enjoying. Now here comes the thing. I gotta figure out which ways to go on these trails. Sometimes I don't quite understand them and the maps. So I will check it out. Oh look, you can kind of see the the lake through the trees there. It is really pretty. Stop Chuck, come here. It is really pretty. So you can zoom in there. Yeah, like I said, it's pretty. Maybe we'll walk down that way. I think it's more camping areas. So, you can see. I could either go that way or that way. Got to consult the map, try to figure this out. All right. I came up here to get away, be on myself, clear my mind, clear the soul, get away from some of the stressors that have been stressing me out, and people that have been stressing me out, and things were great. I get up here, we're starting our hike, it's beautiful, it's nice, it's just Chalk and I, and I start getting text messages, some from the people that have been stressing me out. And of course, me, I cannot not respond. I respond and I'm, I respond because I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling good. So I respond. Then towards the end of my hike, I'm super tired. I have text messages that have stopped. And I start getting grouchy and cranky and bringing up all the things that have been pissing me off and stressing me out. And I think I, I think I just had to tune in with, I was just tired. Sorry, the, the AC's a little warm in here. It's 58 degrees outside, but I'm burning up because the sun's out. So the stressors, they went away for a while and it was good and it was great and I enjoyed it. But now we're gonna go see the Sam Houston Monument and there's some people staring at me. 
Uh, same Houston Monument, even though I'm tired. It's, I drive past it all the time when I go to Dallas. Never stopped, and it's just right up the road from here. So we're gonna go take a picture there, Chalk and I. He's tired too, and then head home. You can see through the trees, there is some Houston. Would you? And then Chuck is all tangled up with me. 